Hey Guyanese family, what's up? Another cooking video for you with my mom, Joan. Here are the list of the ingredients that you'll need for it. Hope you enjoy it. Leave me comments, let me know how your food turns out. Okay, I'm making spread peas cook up for Nikki. That's why Nikki requested today. So, I have onion and garlic. that I sauteed for a little while, onion and garlic and thyme. Then I added some smoked turkey legs and chicken. And that will fry for a little while with a little bit of soy sauce. And a little bit of Worcestershire sauce. I'm adding a little bit of salt to the pot and after this fries for a little while I'm going to add the split peas and some coconut milk after that boils we add the rice and that's it that's split peas cook up rice for you when the rice is finished cooking the pot is finished So first of all, you saute a little garlic and onion and thyme. You add smoked turkey wings or smoked turkey legs on your chicken. Some people would put beef if they so care. Or salt pigtails and salt beef and whatever. Okay, Andy, I'm washing the spit peas. I'm going to add the spit peas to the smoked turkey and chicken that's frying with onion and thyme and garlic in the pot okay so i'm gonna add this bit piece to the pot now was that soaking overnight well pretend it was soaking overnight but nikki just requested this so this didn't soak for too long once you pressure it it's gonna be okay but i like to soak it to get some of the starchiness out of it So what I'm cooking is one cup of spit peas to two cups of rice. Add in the spit peas to the pot. I'm going to put this bone in here for flavor also. I'm about to add the coconut milk to the split peas and meat that's in the pot. And how long have the split peas and meat been in the pot Maybe so far? 10 minutes. Well, the meat's been in for 10 minutes. How long have the peas been in there? About four minutes. It all depends how long you want to, to fry it with the meat for it to absorb some of that flavor. So that was one cup of coconut milk. And I am going to add a cup of water. So one cup of coconut milk, one cup of water? Yeah, I'm going to put some more water. So this is three cups of liquid that's in here. So I'm going to pressure this so that the peas will be softened. this rice to the pot. Okay, I have to add a little bit more water so it have enough water to cook. 
After the rice has been added to the pot, it will take 25 minutes to finish. 25 minutes for the rice to be cooked and the pot will be finished, okay? About how long has the peas been in the just pressure cooker? Just five minutes. Just this to soften it a bit. And then put it on. There goes the rice into the pot. And that's it. How much rice you cook, Mom? Two cups. I think this is more than enough. Yeah, I'm to carry home. Huh? Yeah, I'm going to carry home. Yeah, I'm going to carry I think I have too much water in there now. I'm putting some chicken cubes in here for flavor, bullion cubes. You could use chicken stock instead of water and you wouldn't need the bullion cubes. But you would add salt? Instead? No. If you use if the stock? The, the stock, the stock, if the stock is unsalted, yes, you would need to... Depends, you just taste it. You taste it, you salt taste, it taste. taste, salt to taste. Everything is salt to taste. Some people like salt, some people don't. The fingers don't work too well after a while. I just lay down the chicken or something. I just paint this like that. Your waist and pants. Nikki, mm -hmm. what type of pepper was that? Scotch bonnet pepper, just one? Put it up and I yeah, it's very hot, very hot pepper. What? This cheap. What? Just one. one. Because I was sleeping again. No, you could never have more. Back you back could never have too much time. And that's just for a piece of cup there.